Hello everyone, welcome to the trending stories here on yen.com.gh. I'm Charles Aite. Our first trending story is the wedding of John DeMello to that beautiful lady called Marina. It sparked so many controversies in the entertainment industry, especially from her ex-girlfriend who expressed disappointment in her ex-boyfriend John DeMello dumping her two weeks before the wedding. We've had so many angles to this very trending story, especially when we had the former British High Commissioner John Benjamin post on Twitter a very special but a wedding gift to John DeMello actually it was inscribed with the term V8 we all do know what the V8 is all about that very gift that he received under the administration of the opposition new National Democratic Congress but the other side to this interesting story is also Fiesta condoms they also posted on their Twitter page wishing John DeMello well and you know very much sad that they've lost a top client that tells us so much about John Dumelo. Our second trading story begins with Nanado Dankwa Kufuado. He made a very controversial statement at the 70th anniversary of the University of Ghana's endowment fund. The president st stated that the university was founded by his uncle JB Dankwa. This statement by the president sparked so much debate, especially amongst historians in Ghana. Others of well, the view that, of course, JB Dankwa was part of those who lobbied for the university to be founded here in Ghana and that necessarily doesn't mean that he founded the university actually. Others are also saying that that University of Ghana was rather built on the sweats of cocoa farmers back in the colonial era. But others have also stated that the president was just making this remark to gain political points. We're still following this situation closely to give you updates as and when we do have them. But these have been the trending stories on yen.com.gh. For more trending stories, just visit our YouTube channel. I'm Charles Aite. Catch you later.